It was good. Well, yeah, I mean, I came to a realization when I was watching Tangled uh, in that, uh, like, I'm, I'm in the first week, opening weekend of a movie for kids, surrounded by kids and their parents. Yeah, but you took your three-year-old daughter who wouldn't sit still and wandered up and down the aisle. She wasn't making any noise, Doesn't so that's matter. okay. There was nobody else in the aisle, so it's fine. I'm, I'm just saying that, well, yeah, hey, I'm not saying I'm better than anybody else, even though I am. Well, right. But what I am saying is that depending on the movie you're seeing, you're you're, you're making certain sacrifices, oh, or you're definitely. going into a certain zone. Definitely, you got to be prepared for jerks. But I went and saw 127 Hours, and I went to this Fifth Avenue cinema, which I never go to because it's out of my way. But it was the only place that it was playing, and it's one of the only theaters that has a balcony. So we went up to the balcony and sat in the front row, and it was like perfect level view. It was like put your feet up. It was better than my home, and there was only like. 13 people in the theater because it was 1 o'clock on the Saturday. Yeah. And that was awesome because I got to see an amazing movie that I wouldn't see for another five months. So. All right. Five months? It only came out on DVD. It doesn't take that long anymore. Three months. This movie will be in the theater until March. Yeah, all right. It's going to get a slow build. It's getting a slow release. And by the time Oscars come around, it's going to get nominated. It'll be in the theater until probably mm -hmm. the end of February. I did the Caprice again. Caprice worked out. It's like, you know, 425 each. Free under, if you're under one. I can't believe you've got to be under one to get in free. And the usher didn't even believe my six-month-old daughter was under one. Really? The baby's under one-year-old. Yeah, she's not talking or walking <laughs> or anything. No. And popcorn was cheap. I don't, you know, so, I don't I mean, buy food anymore. You go to the discount theater. You, you don't, I don't, buy, don't buy food anymore? No. The last time was with you at the Harry Potter because we got it for free. So yeah. I felt like I should pay them. That's funny. That's when, I, when I pay $12 to go to a movie... They're getting enough of my money. <laughs> I'm going to give them another $12 so I can eat half a tub of popcorn. Yes, yes. You know, it's just the way it is. I eat before I go. Yeah, I mean, it's just part of the ritual for me. It's part of the ritual. <coughs> I know I've seen you go through a bucket of popcorn. <laughs> <laughs>